King Charles planning to leave show to Prince William once difficult phase is over. King Charles has surreptitiously planned his abdication, reckons one royal author. King Charles is planning to leave the show to Prince William once this incredibly difficult transition phase for the monarchy is over, one royal author has claimed. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. If you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any news about the British monarchy. The expert's prediction comes as Charles finds himself buffeted by multiple headwinds. He ascended to the throne in later life and the firm is still trying to contain the fallout from Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's dramatic exit in 2020. Faced with these daunting challenges, Charles is likely to have already prepared the ground for his retirement. It may have already been surreptitiously planned that the king will abdicate when he's 80, Clive Irving, author of The Last Queen and royal columnist at the Daily Beast, tells Express US. Charles hasn't showed any sign he will get to grips with the scale of the monarchy. He continued, he, Charles, wants to just have his moment in the limelight for a few years, make sure that William and Harry are carried through what's going to be an incredibly difficult transitional phase for the monarchy. And then Camilla can retire to Balmoral and leave the show to William and Princess Kate. I suspect that's what's going to happen. If Irving's prediction proves accurate, Charles will abdicate the throne in five years. However, in his opinion, this is not fast enough. Irving explained, I think it's not a quick enough changing of the guard, but it may be forced on them by circumstances, anyway, in the end. The royal author has been critical of the king's reign thus far. In a previous interview with Express US, he said, I've been surprised by the lack of any sign that he's going to get to grips with the scale of the monarchy, the size of it, and that relates to the cost of it. However, Irving appreciates the reigning monarch is caught between a rock and a hard place. I think Charles feels that it's his duty to serve, having waited so long. But he also knows he's the oldest person ever to have been coronated. Polling suggests the general public is not so down on the king. In August, Ipsos found approximately 60% of people in Great Britain had a positive opinion of King Charles III, compared with 32% who had a negative opinion.